Welcome to the 18th hole here at Prairie Vista Golf Course. My name's Kurt Gibson and I'm the Associate Executive Director at IHSA and our Boys Golf Administrator. And I'm here today on the final day of our Boys Class 1A Golf State Finals on the final hole at Prairie Vista. The final hole is going to play a par 4 of about 380 yards. And I'm out here in the middle of the fairway, about in the area where a player's ball is going to land. And as we look behind me, we can see the, the flag stick on the left side of the green. Players are going to be teeing off and they're going to have their balls generally land in this area around 125 to 140 yards out. The prevailing wind today is going to be coming from left to right on the golfer's shot. So as, as you can see, it's going to want to take balls towards the pond that guards the right side of the fairway in green. If a player can get in this area, he's going to want to play his shot, he's probably going to want to turn it into the wind a little bit, right to left, to try and hold it. And once we get up here to the green, you'll see that his, his, uh, his play on the hole has really just begun once he's been able to navigate his drive. The 18th hole at Prairie Vista has seen its share of drama over the years. It's been the site of a number of last hole birdies to win team championships and propel individuals to the individual state crown as well. And in about five hours, that area that you see on the mounds behind the green are going to be packed with spectators. Right now, our final groups of the morning are just teeing off. You'll be able to follow all the action live online. Had a player teeing off over there. Why don't you show them? Had a player teeing off over there on 17. But you can follow the action on your smartphone or a tablet if you have one at go.ihsa.org slash mobile. But as you can see, as we approach the green, the green runs left to right down towards the water. This weekend, despite all the rain, the Bloomington Golf Division has the greens running somewhere around 10 and a half to 11 on the stimp meter. So you can see now pretty well, I think, how the green contours down left to right. A number of players will find their ball short and left and have to face a fairly difficult chip shot. They're going to have to be very precise with where they land this. They're really going to want to land this just on the green or just short. Because as you'll see, that ball is going to run out and go all the way down to the hole. It's really something they're going to have to navigate. But in about five hours, there's going to be a champion crowd on this green.